What is up guys, it's Cal, and I'm going to show you all the new pets that you can tame as a hunter that came out in patch 7.3. Now there's four of them currently, there might be some more coming out, but for the most part, uh, at least three of these pets are just straightforward tames. One of them, which I'm going to show you right now, uh, there's just a bit of a process to it, and that is taming the panthera, which are those like cat looking things that have like, it looks like crystals or leaves, whatever, just emitting out of their body. And you can also get one of these as a mount. But anyways, there's quite a bit of variations to them. There's a blue one, there's an indigo one, there's like a wider one, there's a green one, and you get what I'm saying. So we're in Corcoran, uh, by the petrified forest, and as you just saw, I tried to tame one of them, but what happens is that they turn sort of invisible-ish, and you just, you can't tame them. As I said, there's a process to it. There's also some more blue colored ones inside the actual petrified forest, as I said before, you know, a lot of different colors of these guys. So what you actually have to do to tame these guys is you can come to this area right here, and you just want to wipe out the Talbuk population in Corcoran. Now there are some Talbuks you can't attack, like there were quite a bit of Talbuks in the Petrified Forest which are not attackable around this area and really all of Corcoran where there are, are Talbuks. Uh, a lot of them you can attack, some of them you cannot, so keep that in mind, but you want to just keep killing Talbuks until you get Talbuk meat to drop, which is a rare chance. I think it's like a 1 to 5% chance, but you'll get it eventually. It did take me uh, I think like 30-ish, 35-ish Talbooks before I finally got it. In fact, after I tamed my pet, I did kill two more Talbooks and then I got it a second time. So, completely random. Now I'm up in Northwest Corcoran, which is the Grove of uh, Naru, I think, something like that, where there are more Panthera cats. These ones are like a shade of blue. So since I got my Talbuk meat up here, I just decided to tame one up here. Now this Panthera that I'm selecting is the one that I was eyeing. And now you can do this one of two ways. You can switch to survival spec, so then you have camouflage because when you tame this guy, he cannot get aggro on you. So you wanna camouflage, approach him, throw down a nice trap, so make sure you're not specced into steel trap, which I was at first and I had to switch but you want to ice trap him throw the meat at him and then immediately start taming because the uh, buff you get for throwing the meat right at him well it doesn't last very long and keep in mind that the range of throwing an ice trap is much much further than the range of throwing a piece of meat i think the range of throwing a piece of meat is like 15 yards or 10 yards i don't know it's it's pretty short now if you don't want to be in survival spec uh you can approach him you can throw an ice trap approach him you will get aggro because you get close enough to him to throw the meat for him to actually get aggro on you then you can feign death to drop aggro and then uh tame him so since i tamed him in survival spec as you can tell he's not an exotic pet none of these pets are actually and his ability is prowl because he is a cat and that is how you tame a panthera and i do want to give a shout out to the wow secret discord community for finding out how to tame these guys and now something to note if you do want to tame all these uh, you don't have to like hearth to dalaran go to true shot lodge or anything to keep stabling your pets there is a stable master at destiny point so you can just keep putting your pet in there to go get another pet. So remember all those Talbuks you were just killing? Yeah, you can you can tame those guys too. They are a new model, you know, they look kind of corrupted. They're pretty cool looking, but that is another pet you can tame, and uh, they don't have any special abilities. They're just, they're just Talbuks. Now these next ones you probably saw while you were around killing Talbuks for the Panthera, and they are Marsouls. They are part of the uh, rodent family, and they're really just all over Corcoran. Uh, they're pretty easy to find. The place where I'm at right now is uh, Northwest. It was where I tamed the Panthera, uh, by the grove of Naru or whatever that place is called. Now the bonus ability that they have is Arrest, which, well, does absolutely nothing. I guess it's kind of similar to uh, the Crane has a special ability called Trick where it just jumps, does absolutely nothing. Well, the Marsouls sleep. And I decided to see if maybe it did possibly do something by getting my Marsoul damaged and seeing if the rest healed him up faster, but uh, it, it didn't, it, it's just for show. Now this final one is the Manta Ray, which has a lot of different variations of it as well. But these guys are flying up high, so they're kind of hard to reach. Though I did find one spot if you go to the Petrified Forest again at 6770, which as you saw was marked my map. And you're just going to go through around this way, uh, just checking where it is, up this path. And uh, you want to get up to a, like a higher ground. This is, you know, higher elevation, so then you can actually reach them. And you want to go... Uh, onto that stump that you, you just saw me like turn away from and i see a manta ray right there but it's obviously too far for me to hit but once a manta ray comes around you do want to shoot it so it gets close to you and then you can tame them and now manta rays are the same as the nether ray family so their bonus ability is heroism or bloodlust and that is that those are four new pets that are now tameable for hunters in 7.3 all of these pets are non-exotic uh, I believe there's worms that come out in Macari. Uh, they're more like grubs, but they're part of the worm family, which does require exotic to tame. Uh, but Macari is not out yet. 
that that comes out the second week. But anyways guys, I hope this video was helpful at all to you. If it was, you can leave a like on it, you can sub to the channel for more videos like this, and I'll see you guys in the next video.